Hello everybody, I hope you're all well. A few years ago I was reading an article on the BBC news site about this chap who wrote a diary entry every five minutes for several decades and they showed this library full of diaries, full of a life lived, or possibly not lived as much as it could have been if he wasn't writing down what he'd done every five minutes. Our Bible reading today reminds me of that man. This is John chapter 21, verse 25. But there were also many other things that Jesus did. If every one of them were written down, I suppose that the world itself could not contain the books that would be written. See, Jesus did far more than is written in the gospel accounts of him, Matthew, Mark, Luke and John. Of course he did. You know, this, this shouldn't be a surprise to us. You can read one of the Gospels in a day easily if you put your mind to it. And Jesus' ministry lasted for three full years. So this verse here reminds us that what we have written down are selected nuggets. And in a way that gives us a guide for how to read the Bible when we get to the Gospels, it's important to ask ourselves, why did the author choose to include this story? What was special about this particular event, this particular parable or bit of teaching or miracle that made them think this bit needs to go in? How does that particular parable or incident help us gain a fuller picture of who Jesus is and, and what he was about, what his message was, how he operates. The Gospels and the rest of the Bible are gifts to us because they give us an understanding into the nature and the mind of God. If anyone is serious about their relationship with God, they need to be serious about reading their Bibles.